Welcome to Designer Digital's Tip of the Week, July 3rd, 2010. This week, creating Yankee Doodle key lines in Photoshop and Elements. Last week's tip focused on creating a thin box around a layout or a photo. This week, we'll alter the key lines to make them look a little less perfect, creating a less formal look. Begin by opening a document and creating a very thin key line. For my 12 by 12 inch document at 300 pixels per inch, I set the stroke to only 15 pixels. Use a dark color to make the line. Although my line is going to end up white, I'm going to start with black to make the next steps easier. Next select the key line layer and choose Filter, Liquify from the menu bar. In Photoshop Elements, choose Filter Distort Liquify. This opens a Liquify Filter dialog box where you can get the Turbulence tool, which looks like waves here. For the sample, I set the brush size to 240, and I left all of the other values at their default. Keeping the cursor relatively straight, drag down along the sides of the box, but avoid the corners. You'll make four swipes, one on each edge. As you drag the cursor, you'll see that the edges become wobbly. If you're unhappy with the way they look, just press Ctrl Z or on a Mac system Command Z to undo and try again. If you want to start all over again from the beginning, remember that you can hold down the Alt key or on a Mac system the Option key to change the Cancel here into Reset. Pressing this will give you your original box before you made any changes. Next, switch to the Forward Warp tool, which looks like a pointing finger here, and use it to make fine adjustments. You can push or pull edges, and here's where you can come in and make changes closer to the corner. When you're finished making your fine adjustments, press OK. Now instead of the formal square that I had before, I've got a fun wobbly one. But I want it to be white, so I'm going to press Ctrl U or on a Mac system that's Command U and drag the lightness slider all the way to the right and click OK. That will turn my black line into a white line. And now you can resize and reposition if you'd like. Try creating a second box in a contrasting color for an extra helping of whimsy. This is a really fun technique to use on summer pages to mimic waves of the pool or the ocean. It also coordinates well with doodled elements. Have some fun with key lines this week and post your pages in the Designer Digital's Idea Gallery. I always enjoy hearing from you. Is there a technique that has you stumped? Email me at howtoatdesignerdigitals.com with your idea and I may be able to help you with a video tip too. A Yankee Doodle Dandy, a Yankee Doodle Do or Die. A real live nephew of my Uncle Sam, born on the 4th of July. I've got a Yankee Doodle sweetheart, she's my Yankee Doodle joy. Yankee Doodle came to London just to ride the ponies, I am the Yankee Doodle boy.